All right, this wraps up our presentations. And I want to congratulate every one of you again for doing a terrific job. And within, within the limited time frame, you did excellent. And any last comments from our guests before we sign off? I just want to say one more thing. Um, I would uh, be kicking myself after if I didn't mention this. All of your projects, and I've gotten the chance to hear most of them, are absolutely amazing. So great, great work. Um, and these projects need to be on your resume. They need to be in your handshake profile. They need to be in your LinkedIn profile. Um, I recognize a lot of you. I've met with a, a good deal of you. So you've heard me tell you this before. But for those of you who haven't heard it, these, these are great things for your project, great things to talk about in interviews. So be proud of what you've done and, and get them out there in, in your profiles and on your resume so employers can see those and um, can help you get a job. So just wanted to mention that. Thank you, Kelly. Important point. Uh, any more comments? Tom, you had something? I um, just wanted to say what an, an amazing job everybody did um, with the constraints, not just time, but, uh, you know, everyone working from home, you know, during a global pandemic. So also having to learn how to, you know, live day to day in a completely different way, plus do this. And, you know, the, the complete lack of access to hardware um, I think was really an interesting challenge. I think it brought out, um, you know, some creative solutions that if you just had, you know, access to, you know, perfect hardware and a LIDAR scanner, you might just lean on that. So you really had to get really creative and work with really tight constraints. And, and that's something I love. I've, you know, I come from the game industry and uh, that's what we do is we try and make the impossible happen in one sixtieth of a second. Um, and so it's, it, it speaks, it speaks to a part of my soul to have these kind of oddball constraints and to be able to come through in the end with something is so satisfying and you should all be so incredibly proud. Really incredible. Great job. Yeah. That's a great compliment. Yes. I, uh, I echo what, uh, what Tom mentioned and, and, and I think I mentioned this in, in, in one of the previous, you know, presentations, uh, what amazes me is, uh, you know, because of the time constraint, just just the fact that you're able to, you know, try out things, and and make decisions, and 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 go forward with those decisions, and and get results. I mean, uh, you know, that takes a lot of uh, uh, guts and perseverance. I think you know to, uh, you know, to go with with uh, with your instinct and with with what you're learning at at the moment, and um, that would. That's what impresses me the most. And I think, you know, all of these projects are just awesome. Actually, there's a couple of them that can be combined uh, you know, to create even a, uh, you know, a hybrid um, project. Um, the, writing, the writing one and the translation one, you know, I think could be, could be combined. That's a good observation, Sam. Anyway, I really enjoyed it. Thank you. Thank you for your comments. Sure. Any any other comments before we sign off? I'll just say also um, very impressive. Uh, been in this industry for many years, and um, uh, to see the kind of uh, results that you've gotten in a short period of time, uh, it takes engineers uh, with experience a long time to get applications right, um, and and to be repeatable, right? That's, that's the big thing. They have to be repeatable when you're talking about, you know, something um, uh, that you talked about cars, you know, not crashing into people and things like that when there's danger involved and so on in machines, they have to be repeatable. Um, so the job that you did in a very short period of time, all of you, uh, was very impressive. I was very impressed. I'll be back next year uh, to watch more of this. And, uh, to, to grab two hours of my time this morning. I, I never thought I'd sit here for two hours, to be honest. I thought maybe I'd peek in for a little bit, but this was, it grabbed my attention. Uh, well, well done, everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. I want to say it was a pleasure seeing a lot of familiar names and faces from previous classes. So it's good to see you all. I enjoyed this a lot. I learned some things. And again, also with the two hours, I didn't expect, I was thinking two hours, it's going to be a while. <laughs> It went by pretty quick, so um, I really appreciate it. It's good to see everybody, and good luck with your finals.
And it's just, great to meet the other guests too. <clears throat> just, just one more comment. You know, I uh, also applaud Dr. Mirza and Oakland University for um, for doing this and and for being, you know, as successful with it as uh, as they have been for the last you know three presentations that I've seen. So, kudos to you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. It's all students. I, I, these are the three best lectures for me. I sit back and enjoy. <laughs> okay. Thank you, everyone, and especially the guests for joining and the students. Again, great job. Enjoy your turkeys now. Take care, everyone.